Salutations, my friends. I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blues, playing as that beautiful Western Brotherhood of Steel. Or just Western Brotherhood. Last time, we were distracted by those folks further east, called the Aedes, the White Legs, or Ammonites, and pretty much also ter territory over here. So I asked you guys yesterday whether I should release these little nations in Utah, and whether, whether or not we should or should not. So obviously, as you can tell, I have released them. I released them just because it does... It makes it a little better. I mean, yeah, we can spend manpower and equipment. They're all under us now, which makes it look okay. This definitely looks a little better. And we have our own faction, so obviously we got to make sure this faction continues expanding. And it's not too bad. It does look a little better, even though it looks it's still a little messy. But it is what it is. Also, someone asked, is there a way when you release a nation for the released nation to go down a particular path? Well, technically yes and no. Yes and no because if you do it early in the game before the any nation that you took over has gone down a particular route like let's say they're like at the beginning of the game you're playing as the western brotherhood of steel and you take out like i don't know let's say for the shady sands republic for example you take them out early on then they'll most likely go down the path that that's available to them if they have an intellectual path so technically yes they can go down the focus tree path that best aligns with their ideology if you take them over as intellectuals but by mid game to late game it won't happen. They can't go down a particular focus tree path just because they've already stuck to the other stuff before they were taken over. So yes and no. Mostly no, but a little bit of yes. Sometimes. Uh, let's see. There's another comment. I can't remember the top of my head. Right now we're still at war with the Confederacy of the Day Globe, And we're trying to get our power armor down there. And I do want to go to war with the Shady Sands military state eventually. But we'll see what happens. Let's go sell some equipment. And actually now, since we liberated some of those guys, we should get a little. Bit, we have gotten a little bit more manpower back, which is good. And we're still doing some development projects. Let's just send some or provide some power armor to scavengers because that's always good. And here we go. You look at all the puppets we've got now. Oh, so beautiful. So beautiful. Actually, can I request garrison support maybe? Uh, no. No. Alarming trend. National sentiment is beginning to rise in one of our subjects. Words like self-determination, freedom, and liberty are being spoken by powerful figures in the 80s for far too often for our liking. If we don't do something about this now, this sentiment may get out of hand. Uh, It's nothing. It, it, it's... That's not much. I mean, I can lower their autonomy really quickly if I just build stuff in their lands. No one wants to give me garrison support. What, do they all have, like, no, like, no manpower just because we pretty much murdered them all? What? No. Uh, well, that is interesting to see, though. Earning our place. Yeah, they have their own focus tree. When you take them over as a Brotherhood of Steel, that's really, really awesome. March on the capital. Earning our place. They get more, we get more manpower. They lose manpower. But they get a lot more autonomy, which is not nice. Scribe initiation. That's cool. Learning from the ancients. Uh, cool. Tutelage. Old world medicine. Uh, power armor maintenance. Nice. Ooh, they could use power armor eventually? That's really awesome. So, new scientific discoveries gives them political power of all things. Okay. Cool. Very cool. Power armor training. So, we train our puppets in the art. It's an art of using power armor. The art of war, obviously. Technology raids. A new chapter. Oh, that'd be really cool. The 80s chapter. That's so awesome. Duty, honor, and courage add a lot more autonomy. Well, we'll see what happens. And let's see. So, we're pretty much done with this part of the tree. Great industry. And we're done over there. And let's grab some scrap shacks as well. That'd be very good. And some raiding flotillas. Good, good, good. Let's grab some aggressive maneuvers. Very nice. Last time we... We were previously beat in a naval battle before in this campaign. But then we started doing our naval doctrine. And then we actually beat the enemies. Which is a very good thing. Uh, we're about to get paid soon. That's good. We can clamp down on autonomy, but I want to save up for more uh, manpower. I think that'd be good. i will grab some rocket launchers because we could definitely use those. And now we have some more knights we could use. Yes, please. Yes, 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 please. And here they are. The knights. Cool. Throw them on the line. Yeah, I definitely want to throw my guys over here to help them out. Machine assisted encryption. Very good. Get some diplomatic training. No longer get industrial support. So be it. Whatever. <sighs> Not bad. Uh, so, oh, that was, I remember the comment from yesterday. Now, someone recommended that we take up the timber line. They look pretty needing a new some so, new authority. New authority figures there. They need that. So we'll probably do that. Uh, let's see. Wasteland pacification still. Sorrow's cipher is done. Grand tribe cipher is done. Let's get some smoocher Lemuel. Carnot. Bowie. Sems. Norton. Let's get Car Lemuel. I'm going to get Lemuel the smoocher. Grand Tribes is done. Any more cryptology we need to really focus on? Doesn't really matter. Let's go and do that, 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 that. We'll get as much as we possibly can get done. There we go. And you guys are taking your sweet time getting over there. Even though we already pretty much ready to go to war with all those guys down there. 
and it looks like we're getting core something. Now let's let time go on. I don't want to wait. So, oh, a focus. Good. And I do need to address something a little later on too. Second Valley Expedition. Our last venture into the valley came up profitable. Our scribes were dedicated on finding anything worthy in terms of knowledge which would have been extracted from their finds. But this time, we need basic raw materials to ensure our survival. Uh, we get resources. What type of resources do we need? Well, the lowest amount of resources, this is advanced components, right? No, it's comp composite components. This is advanced components. Composite materials, which we could probably use. Advanced components are pretty good. Uh, doesn't really matter. We need more of this. Actually, we extract technically more of this than anything else. Let's go grab some Let's grab some advanced components, because you never know when you might need that. So, you know what? I'm just going to do this now. I forgot to do this off-screen. So, we're going to go in and do Military Flight Academy. So, we're going to do, in the cons command, focus.auto... Complete. I have to autocomplete it just because I don't want anyone else's focus trees in the entire uh, world here to get all done as well. And then you gotta go focus dot no checks. So then you can uh, uh, focus. Did it complete? Oh, I still can't select it. Okay, so I still can't select it. So if you ever need to know cons commands, there's a two that if you need it, no helps you do it immediately and get them through. But we don't re meet the requirements, so we can't do that. That is something that needs to be overlooked. But Oh well. Or that's something that needs to be looked. My apologies about my words. They are very confusing sometimes. Robo Insights. The Brotherhood has collected much information regarding robotics, its manufacturing techniques, and facilities or faculties in combat, but has never successfully used robots before. Perhaps we should delve into this idea. Not a bad idea. Not a bad idea at all. Uh, and our power armor is down there, technically. Go, get involved. See what you can do with about planes. That oh god, yeah, that's right. We get no planes down here. Hmm. Oh, why? Actually, we do get a little bit of combat. Nice! Actually, we're actually doing a little bit. Nice! We can actually help out guys here. Very good. Uh, I would tell you guys to push, but you might end up dead. How strong are these guys? Because we'll, we'll finish these guys off to help pay back the Rapids. Pay back Megapolis 1 for helping us out against New Mariposa and pretty much everyone else. Even though I still want to betray them. Which is not a cool thing to do, but sometimes it is. So... Uh, we'll help them take out the. Ra Actually, are we just finding anyone? We'll take out the rapids for them too. No, we're not. Go and go to war them too. We'll give them as much territory as possible so they can have a lot of problems, and then we'll probably kill them. At least that's the plan. Sac City, you're next. Ah, uh, about four thousand more manpower. Nice, nice, nice. Auto injectors, cool. Get some, get some heavy machine guns. Yes, please. Seventeen thousand, thirteen thousand, seventeen thousand, almost eighteen right there. Uh, yeah, we'll probably do. Ooh. Yeah, we gotta do this one. Gunderson Ranch, that's that's just so much population you gotta use. You got a lot of factories though. Lots of factories, don't need behemoths. Uh, put them down. Uh, actually, we'll, we'll, we'll probably use support robots, not combat robots actually. For garrison stuff, if we can. Anything here? Not really. Scrap shacks are cool. Get some scrap bots. Suppression is 0.5. Well, it is what it is. More hardness is better. If you wanna do resistance stuff, you gotta get hard. Alright, you know what? Can you guys actually be on the offensive at all? Yes. Just go ahead. That's going to be kind of a grind, but at level 7, unit leader Paladin Houston. Yeah, he's he's doing a good job. Now, hopefully our allies, or Megapolis 1, can actually push up with these guys, because no one's going to be able to stop these guys. Once they start going, these guys just don't stop. Awesome, we got the rocket launchers pretty quickly. Grab some vital, target, vital point targeting, that'd be good as well. Uh, let's come over here. Nice. Very nice. We still need to focus a little more on naval tech. That's fine with me. Uh, how many men have we lost? 120 versus... Oh, I've got 3,000 almost. Not bad. Plastic explosives. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I probably want to concentrate our forces maybe a little bit better than this. So let's do that. If anything, you guys could probably go right here, 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 and there. Go to Salt City. Did we hit something? Yes, we did. Just a little bit. Just a little. We hit their navy just a wee bit. Defensive online, great. Robo insights, cool, cool, cool. And we'll do some further insights. Further insights into this skill will gather many more fruitful results. Having a core understanding would both allow us to maximize our efficiency in fueling them in combat if we so choose, or facing against them in combat. Our scavengers now tr return to with naval technology bonus. Yes, good stuff. Suicide runs, I love suicide runs. Fun stuff. All right, so you guys go this way. Take all but one, go that way, take off but two, and take off one more so you can go right there. Force the attack. Don't let them through. Now, with our allies attacking, as we do have our attack planes in the air and fighters, we should do relatively okay. Conglomerate of Hope will declare war on the mo- Oh, no, 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 no. They don't technically touch us, so we're going to say yes. Our allies are state of Utilbithia. How dare you? 
That's been a while since I've played as Hopefield. Maybe I should play as him again sometime. Ryan Jefferson. Because I, I have played as this group and I, did I become an Enclave or something? Hardliners arrive? Yeah, I think I did. So I went on this path. The hills have Lebensraum. Now that sounds awesome. Oh my goodness. The hills have Lebensraum. Coach Guns, awesome. Cool, keep going. Keep, uh, yeah. All the Republics want to come in, that's fine. And we're about to get paid soon, too. Good! How about settlement still? Kitsap? Yes, please. Oh, I love it when everything comes together. 11 divisions are encircled there, and 13 are encircled right there. See, all you need is a spot of power armor, and you guys can do really, really well. I mean, they're, they're not quite 40 combat, but they're only 37.5, but... And I'm lowering their armor, too, which is not ideal, but... Less supply problems, I think is good. You know what? Let's raise their supply. This, this is probably not a good idea to use support power armor, but I never use support company for it. I never ever use it. Oopsie. Ooh. Yeah, I don't want to lower the armor anymore, so that's pretty good already. I gave him logistics, and I gave him support company power armor boys. Just in case, just because, well, I never use them, and I want to use them, finally. Uh, the next place to attack would be right here. Put everyone right here, and then go boom, boom. There you go. Easy. Move on over if you can. Get everyone over there. Supply is probably going to be just a little bit of an issue, but, you know, whatever. I'll actually, go... If you can go right there, actually, instead. Take one, all but one. Take two. There you go. Boom. There you go. You got this. Force the attack. Uh, let's see. Very good, very good. Just a matter of time before they fall. Man, that 20,000 losses. I don't know why. That, that flag always reminds me of Ohio for some reason. What does the Ohio flag look like? The state of Ohio. Protectorate of the hub, huh? HMGs, very cool. We could grab that. Let's grab some better doggos. Love the doggos. Love the doggos. Go on train if you need it. Nice, 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 nice. Great. We completely encircled Greater Dayglow. Uh, I'm going to leave it up to our allies to take that out. So instead, I'm going to wait for all of these guys to get over where they need to be. And hopefully these we don't get encircled here. But Lava God, I hope we don't. And we're just going to keep pushing. We should not get in circles, so just push. Well, it might help if I give you orders down here. Hey, oh, we, we, we went back, and we're actually doing stuff down here. So we sunk a task force. Convoy, convoy, convoy. Nice. Industrial expertise. Did he learn anything yet? He's level 4. We got some further insights into robotics. Very cool. Uh, resource scouring? Yes. One of the biggest issues facing the Brotherhood is a collection of basic and fundamental resources. Things such as water and raw materials are sorely needed in desperate times like this. Having a sizable stockpile of these resource energies or ensures our capacity is not stagnated by the raw necessities any post-war nation should possess. We get a whole 12 water. A whole 12 water. Wow. Very useful. Water is useful, but... Hmm. And the reason I'm not attacking here, really, I guess I am. I wanted the enemies to starve a little bit more, because if they don't get... They barely get any supplies if they're not connected to the capital, so... That's why I did not want to attack the capital, but, you know, the AI... Not the smartest. But it is what it is. Uh, they're pretty... They're not close to capitulating, though. Oh, ran a couple divisions here and there. Nice, very nice. Vital point targeting. Very good. Let's grab some Medex, even though we don't use it on our power armor, but we can still use it. Nice, 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 nice. Good job, guys. Good job. Uh, come over here and help these crush these guys over here. Because we should be able to go to war very soon with the Rapids, too. After the Rapids, we'll probably go to war with... Oh, God. These guys are not looking good. Twisted hairs are down here. Conglomerate of Hopewell Operative Captured. Well, we got to kill them off. So, Twisted Hairs... We might just have to go to war with you, then. Who's this? Prim and Hopewell has this as a core. Well, okay. Hmm... If that's the case, I guess it's time for Conglomerate Hope Bill. Oh, well, technically, yes. I suppose so, yeah. I guess it's Twisted Hairs, technically, so. How long would it take for us to go to war with them? That's a bit too long. Not gonna lie. You guys keep going. You're doing a great job. There goes Siege of Hidden Valley. Now I host them as Exile Government, which is a weird thing to think of in Mojave, but that's okay. Actually, how many have they lost? 4,000. That's not bad. Mojave Chapter, I'll definitely help build them up once we're done here, though. Strap bots. Good stuff. Uh, more naval stuff, actually. Gallery! Composite rams. Very cool. 
And that was another comment from yesterday. Uh, if you're watching this ahead of time or beyond October 23rd, 2020, well, the comment was that the next update for Overworld Blues comes out on October 23rd, so. Cool. And also, uh, I probably won't have ac early access to it. Probably not. So I can teach you guys all the new mechanics. But that's just me. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I really probably won't, though, which is unfortunate. Decker Construction Zone. Without any doubt, we are a force to be reckoned with on land, but in the sea? That's a different question entirely. We shouldn't let our potential go to waste with our industry up and running. Who is to say the Brotherhood couldn't become the dominant sea power too? Well, who is the dominant sea power? I mean, maybe maybe portions of California are, maybe? Maybe? Let's go investigate some rumors since it takes so long to do. It's ha it takes half a year, which is ridiculous. Commando training, interrogation techniques, very cool. I, I did totally didn't want to take up the capital because I wanted to exterminate all of our enemies down here. Totally did not want to do that. Totally did not want to do that at all. Hmm. Goodbye. Are you? St oh wait! Oh, you're. Oh wait! Wait! When do we go to war with these guys? Uh, I didn't realize we were at war with them. Okay. Well, whatever. Let the power armor do whatever the power armor needs to do. Put them down. Put them down. Got a lot of air fuel, which is pretty nice. Lost a jet fighter, but sunk two destroyers. This is not bad. There goes the Murtaugh Reformers. Ah, there we go. Now we can go justify on probably these guys next. That's quite a long time. 165 days. Are you kidding me, son? That's a lot of days. That's yeah, a new paladin. Or, or Lucas Wilson, I guess. Bunker kid. That's not ideal. Whatever. We'll deal with him. Gunslinger. He's going to be an infantry guy, so... Uh, get more of that first. And Commando. I want more attack on the infantry. So that means you are kind of independent right now. I'm not going to put you up here because that's going to kill you off probably if I actually do that. So I'm actually going to put you right there. Something easy. Something not too bad. There you go. Nice. Uh, let's get some more naval stuff going so we don't produce garbage. I think at this point we're pretty good on naval expertise. Or naval... Naval Doctrines, I should really say. Uh, so, with that in mind... Oh, you got more divisions. Oh, yeah, that's right. Uh, three right there. That doesn't really matter. Military training, 20 combo width. That's not bad. Oh, that's not great, though. And this is power armor. Not bad, but... Yeah, could be, could be better, could be worse. That's okay. They're doing their best. Grab a battle barge. Thank you very much. Get these guys on the line. 4,000. Not bad. 39,000, that ain't enough. How much has McLaughlin's won? That's a lot of people. 14,000 people. How dare you? I'm mean, gonna guess it is your own people, but whatever. Dockyard construction. Let's do some underground hangars. Reconfiguring and re the reconstruction of these un underground hangars will undoubtedly ease our resurgence as a power in the waste. Very, very cool. Definitely trying to still sing stuff. What, what, what just happened? Something happened there? All right, try to help him out now. Yep, there we go. Megapolis One is nothing without us. Look at all that air damage. Woo! And they died. All right, let's take all the score so we can divvy out them results. Please, someone else, just follow me right now, please, please, please. There you go. There you go. That's what we wanted to do by the end of last episode, but whatever didn't happen. Twisted here is pretty large. Not gonna lie. Can you actually get up there? No, we can't. Hmm. So it seems like that means we're going to have to kill off the Shady Sands Republic first. So that we can get to the conglomerate of Hopeville. I guess technically we could invade, but that's probably not going to be in our best interests. Navally invade, I mean. Because there's no, <laughs> no naval base over there. So yeah, we're gonna have to kill these guys off. Definitely. I mean, we're already justifying on the twisted hairs. Eh, that's not bad. How long would it take to go to war with these guys, the Desert Rangers? It's not bad. I'd, I'd sooner go to war with the. Uh... Hey, we're done with this stuff. Nice. Sooner go to war with other folk. These guys first. And if that's the case, hopefully power armor does it. Oh, we just went in there. Okay. Or power armor. I'm probably just going to take these guys over as a puppet. 
I gave all this territory to them because I was nice to them. Oh my goodness, they got so much resistance. Oh, that's such a bad idea. Now they have... Hmm. Do they not get cores? Oh, no, 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 no. You gotta get cores. Come on. Come on, guys. You don't get cores. Oh, that might have been a really bad idea. Composite stuff. Twin mounted HMGs. Very cool, very cool. If that's okay. You know what? So be it. Mm, I don't want to core this stuff for them because it doesn't make sense for me to. Uh, do they really not have this as cores or a way to core? I hope, I hope they can get political power to core this stuff because I don't want to just kill them off. Well, that means we got to hurry up. Go to war with the Twisted Hairs. I'm going to puppet all of them. Go to war with Hopeville. Probably give this to the Mojave chapter, or actually Hopeville itself, just because they have a core on it, don't they? Yeah, and you guys have a core state too. I'll probably give it a Hopeville. Well, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Grab a Scorpio. Let's see. Over here. Do you have this as a core? They do have it as a core, so. But I gotta get my Mojave chapter back. It's unacceptable what they did to it. But let's continue on with. What else? Oh. Hacking the Hublink. We'll do that soon, a little later, but we'll do that eventually. Brotherhood veterans. Many within the Brotherhood, new and old, are willing to call to muster. While during peacetime, many of these good men and women may be put into scrabble efforts and put those away from the field, this is a different time. We all need, we need all the help we can get, and they have answered the call. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Cool, because I, I, first of all, I want to smash through the Desert Rangers as fast as possible to get this army over here ready to go, and then come down here... And then you guys are going to hold more than fine, probably. I'm not really too worried about the infantry. But plane-wise, how are we doing? We have got 100 biplanes right there. we got a battle barge right in front of us. There you go. Battle barges. Eh, that's a little bit ahead of time. Go ahead and grab some nuclear hydrojets, because we can. And then we're going to come over here and do a little bit more. District support is gone, whatever. Monoplane fighters. So be it. Are we about to get paid? Yes, we are. Cybernetic enhancements. Cool. Throw some more guys on there. Throw some more guys over here as well. Oh, we can lower the autonomy of someone. That's cool. Oh, uh, cyber doggos might as well. Alright, who can we lower the autonomy of? The 80s, probably. To a Brotherhood Dependency. Only cost 50. That's not bad. Defenses are online. Great. Oh, that's actually really good. Nice. Arcjet, which one do we have? Robco? No. Oh, Lockreed. Carrier fighters, fighters, agility, max speed. Eh, I guess we can use it for now. It's fine. I want to core more stuff, but we'll see what happens. Mm hmm. Get into their airbase. That'll be good. And what else do we need here? Fighters. We need more fighters. I got some blimps, not many. And we'll do preparing for war. <clears throat> we must prepare ourselves for the final test. As such, our industry must not be forgotten. Forging new manufacturers and armaments will remedy this. Whatever we face, the threats head on. We will face them head on completely. Ooh, you know what? What type is what type of stuff is this? Are you, uh... Nope. Goodbye. I want the manpower. Twenty combat with. I could use you as. Uh, can I convert you all right now? To forties. Okay. Good enough for me. Fine with me. I don't care. Mm, light robots will keep you. Train exploration, we'll get rid of you, get rid of you. Cool. Keep we're gonna keep one on uh, naval doctrines for now. That'd be good. And we should be able to go to war very, very soon with the twisted hairs, yeah. In a few months, it'll be really quick though. Real quick. Actually, how much manpower does Hope they'll have? Because by the end of this video, I want to go to war with the Shady Sands folks. Mm, how's their Air Force doing? Eh, they got a few fighters. A few fighters, not bad. 590, cool, let's do this. Uh, clamp down on stuff. Restore the Nasui, yes. Pretty good, pretty good. Sell some stuff, probably, too. That'd be good. And military research. Uh, Prior to consumer, consumer goods, that's good. Because we have more than enough there. And in the meantime, what else can we build up in terms of, uh... Infrastructure. Might as well build, 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 right? Very good, very good. Just in case we got to move anywhere here quickly. And I think the next episode will be the last. We're going to betray probably Megapolis 1. We'll take out all the Pacific, maybe except for Mexico. Or all the states that border the Pacific or have the Pacific Ocean next to them. And yeah, I think we'll call it a campaign after that. I might still want to take out Heaven's Gate since 
we might as well. So, scribe initiation, very cool, very cool. This way, no one can rebel. Three mounted HMG is very awesome. Grab some crop mowers, awesome, awesome, awesome. Prepare for war, you bet we are. Get some of that, grab some of that, grab some of that right there. Very good stuff. And we could have the hub link, but I'm not going to yet. Uh, Descendants of the Wander, we could try that. So the legendary vault dweller built a thriving settlement in Northern California. It may be prudent to approach them in the interest of forming an alliance. Even though they are long dead. Technically we don't have them as core, so if I release them, that might be okay with me. Just because... We don't have them as cores, and that's kind of okay to put them down like that. It's okay. Sometimes you have to put them down. Okay, that's all the way maxed out, that's all the way maxed out. Cultural Advisor, Decorated Heroes, not bad, we could do that too. Uh, Recon, Field Expert, Recovery Rate. I'm gonna do Recon, I want more Division Speed and Recon Decryption, that'd be kinda nice. Cool. 1.47 a day, not bad, 22,000 is not bad at all. Scorpios, awesome. Grab some 37mm deck guns, cause, why not? So many things here. Uh, Ammonites, how are you doing? Start lend lease maybe a little bit. You would you like ten thousand guns? There you go. From here on out, we're gonna set this to medium. Cause that'll be you know what, set it to high. Screw it. Set it to high. We want to upgrade as many things as possible right now. Light robots, eh, it's not bad. Uh, actually you might be able to throw on some doggos. Vanish scouts, oh no, well crap, that's not good. But it lowers our uh, probably our hardness a little bit, but whatever. All right, let's go see if we can find them out. Investigate. Oh, we can investigate rumors again. That's fine. We can try that. Uh, oh, they just vanished. They're not even missing. They just straight up vanished. Cool. Well, it's not cool that they vanished, but we got our thing done. It's all crap. Time to do that. That'd be awesome. Go ahead and grab some more naval stuff. Grab some spar torpedoes. Very awesome. And let's go to war. We can finish all this stuff here. Good. Better doggos? That's what I like to see. Uh, Megapolis 1, please come in. Oh, did you course some of this or something? Oh, you already have this as course, I guess. Hopefully they can spend political power to core this area, because they really need a core for themselves. And here we go. The fight against Hopeville shall continue. We'll turn Hopeville into a chapter. The Descendants of the Wanderer, cool. We can't do any of this because they don't exist, so... Cool. Um, I don't want to release Hubal just yet. I want to wait just a little bit longer. I want to use your lands for as much as... Oh god, why did you do that? Do not abandon in those areas. Okay, phew. Because I don't mind dealing with these guys. They ain't that bad. But... And there's a huge but. Hmm, Vault 3. I think at this point we just go to war with these guys. 50 days, that's nice. Currently get 2.47 a day, not bad, not bad. Oh yeah, we gotta deal with these guys over here too, but whatever. Forgot we were at war with them. I'm still focused on Hopeville, it's not even funny. Can they actually pierce me? Uh, no, I can't. I wanna see a lot of casualties here. 84 divisions, 5,000 losses, area denial. I'm gonna start focusing a lot more now on this stuff, just so that we can get it all done. I wanna make some real good ships. Charleston, do any upgrades? What is he learning? Desert Fox, Urban Assault Specialist is good. Same thing, that's not bad. How close are you to leveling up, though? Yeah, he's halfway, cool. Losses thus far, 7,000, not enough. Crap mowers, not enough. Uh, automatic reloading systems, nice. Very nice, uh, can we sell some stuff? No, we cannot. That is unfortunate. Wartime administration. Lose political power. You can have a little bit more autonomy. It's fine. Slaves. The boomers are using slavery. What, for their phones? I can see that. Cool. Come on. Only 9,000 have died. Come on. A little bit more. A little bit more. Resistance suppression. Oh, they're running out. They have less than 1,000. Even the... You know, the counter in the game, and the, every day it updates. Because now they have less than 500 manpower, which is beautiful. All I need is for Megapolis 1 to hold. That's all I need them to do. Hold the line. That's all I want infantry to do, is just hold the goddamn line while the power armor come in and just 
demolish everyone in front of them. Look at all these planes. Look at all these fighters in the air. They're still attacking without ma with no manpower, which is a really stupid idea. But you know what? I'll let them do it. Deck guns, cool. Grab some catapults. Very cool. Assault craft, we can finally make good assault craft, but we're not going to yet. Because we don't need to. And mostly because I want to get the best stuff on them anyways, so. If that's the case, how are you guys doing? Uh, go ahead and train instead. I want more naval XP before we do anything else. Alright, looking pretty good, looking pretty good. He's definitely becoming a desert fox, which is nice. Only 14,000. We've only killed off 10,000 of them, that's all. They have only 87 divisions. Construction repair. And they're completely out of manpower. Oh, I'm going to war with them immediately. Oh, god dang it. Come on, man. So, we need to go to war by August 18th. Which we might be able to do if they kill themselves fast enough on our line. Can I grab any more fighters or, like, close air support? Yes. Wait, why do we have two? Oh, those are Mark 1s. Um, yeah, that's fine. Houston, I'm surprised you weren't wounded earlier. That's fine, you know what? You guys come right here. I forgot about these guys. I'm gonna have you guys do that over here first. Just to help smash the living crap out of them from the Goblins 1. If you could do that, that'd be awesome. And over here, we're doing pretty well anyway, so... Really not too worried. Oh, they're just mowing people down as they come at them. This is so sad. I'm gonna re-justify on, um... Shady Sands Ball. That goes to Hona Nation. Get a trebuchet. Those are pretty cool to get. I wish I could build one in real life. Eh, maybe I should someday. Then again, where would I put it when it's done? Lots of air XP. That's so nice. Yeah, they're, they're just throwing their guys at the line constantly. 75% done. Or other way there. Can I, can I attack, please? Can I please attack? You haven't lost any divisions, but you killed off 20,000 men so far. What a, bu a bunch of big dum-dums. Huge bunch of dum-dums. I just want to puppet you, that's all I want to do now. Yet they won't take this tile over. It's kind of weird. Kind of strange, not going to lie. Alright, actually, did I even give you orders? No, I did not. Okay, go ahead and plan. I should have done that earlier. My, that's my fault. My bad, man. Woof! I should have given him way more planning. Ballistas? I love ballistas. Grab some alloy castings. Very nice. Three. I want to get a little more planning bonus. Two. Max planning. You get 2.4 every day. One. Get up to 16 and we'll go. Alright, let's go. Now, it's going to be a little bit more of a struggle probably, but that's okay. Are you guys struggling over here? Eh, a little bit. But look at that. That's so nice. Ah, there we go. Sell all the equipment. Automatic reloading systems. Cool. Let's grab some 57mm deck cannons. Love it. Oh, yeah. We don't have a lot of divisions attacking, but you don't always need a lot of divisions. All you need are the best divisions. Grind out that enemy. Grind those forces out. Destroy every single last vestige of them until we repair them. Ourselves. We're about to get paid soon, too. Look at that. So beautiful. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Infantry divisions. Or those infantry divisions, yeah. Ooh, and now they can't, probably can't even do resistance stuff. Oh, we encircled... How many divisions we encircled? We encircled so many. I'm going to say at least 20-ish. Maybe close to 20. Yeah, it's probably 20 divisions over here. Oh, that is so sad. Can we please set off some fireworks? <laughs> Pew! Ah, uh, nice. Yep, they lost 22 divisions so far. But they're only going to lose more. We're only doing how much damage? 77-ish? Only doing anywhere between 60 to 80... Ground support, cl close air support damage. Not even close air support, just damage. Ground support, oh my goodness. Oh boy, they're piling in here now. It's not, it's not good, guys. Why can't you just hold the goddamn line? That is so sad. Uh, Agopolis, you better hold this line. I know I went to war with these guys too, but whatever. So, you guys hold the line. We're going to deal with the Twisted Hairs really, really quickly. We were doing so well. So well. I should probably make more power armor divisions now. That actually would probably be a good idea. Make forward in time, just like the infantry, secondary engines. Awesome. Miles of good floating fortresses now. 
And who can we lower? Oh, the Aegis. Wow, we just went straight up Annex them. Wow. Hopeville, of course they got slaves. Oh, of course they would. Uh, Junk Town, awesome. That's good. Keep ours on for now. Gunnerson Ranch would be good. So we get down here next. 36,000. Awesome. Fences are online. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Take him out, take him out. Need to go to war by when? The 26th of October, which we should be able to get done. Yeah, you guys definitely start spreading out a little bit better. Uh, I'm going to have you hold just in case. Just because I have gotten a lot of divisions circled when they left the center area here. When the only what access to supply base was over there. So we're not going to get these guys killed off like that. No, thank you. Trebuchet is awesome. Grab some 20 millimeter auto cannons. You guys, West Arizona, come on over here back. That'd be great. Even more. Just more. You know what I want? I want more. <laughs> Gonna do that too, that's fine. We'll get them done eventually. Not really, not too worried about it. If we really want them done, we'll just do this. There you go, you got four things of like 40 factories being made. Literally, like 40 factories. Cool. You guys should be able to win very soon. Uh, Golden Valley shouldn't be too much of an issue. Get off 12,000 of these guys, 28,000 of those guys. You still can't push up without me, can you? That is so pathetic. Hmm. What a shame. What a shame. Good Springs, uh, yeah. How's uh, the chapter doing? NCR, what? What is this? NCR negotiations. What? Are you going to betray me? What? What? No, 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 puppet. Awesome. I normally don't ever pop it, but, you know, I don't want to deal with manpower loss. I just want to enslave the enemies. I, I mean, use them for research projects. I mean, um, um, put them under us so that they can live in a better lifestyle. Live a better lifestyle, yeah, totally. And for this, I'll give this probably to Hope, though, just because it'll maybe look a little better. No one else has cores on it, so. Intellectuals bound by steel, yes, they will be. Yeah, I might give this to Hope, because they already have a core, and I don't want twisted hairs on the side of Cal on the river, so. You guys will do fine, I'm not too worried about that. What the heck are you doing, though? Mojave chapter. What are you doing? NCR trade? Tr Treaty of Sloan? Military pact? Oh, you know what? Do it. I hope they do it. I really hope they do. You know why? So we can get rid of the Mojave chapter for the traitors that they are? No wonder we cast them out before. Oh, my goodness. How dare you? Hmm. No. Everett? Yes. Uh, power armor scavengers, why not? Consumer technology, eh, why not? Beautiful. They, they cannot stand up to us, which is awesome. Oh, when you go to war, you know what? Screw it. Just, just find them again. I, I, we have to be, like, really ready to go when this when this fires. Like, we all have to be just immediately ready to go. It's just taking too long for this stuff. Oh, my goodness. Recall operated shell extractors. Not bad, not bad. And we've killed off a lot of Hopeville folks. 25,000 to be exact. A little more than 25,000, but that's okay. More sand? I hate sand. It's coarse and gets everywhere. Of course. Of course. Oh, I want to investigate rumors. Uh, I'm just going to pop it, you guys. There you go. Alright, so, like I said earlier, I want to smash through this section as fast as humanly possible. So we're going to focus on the Desert Rangers, and then meet the enemy armies down here when they just spread out like cancer, or wildfire. Either, take your pick, you know, it doesn't really matter. Uh, you guys own this? Stop it, I don't want to see the military stuff. Um, hmm. You know what, I'm going to do this immediately. I'm going to convert you over here. But I'm going to make you trade this to the chapter, but I'm going to corporate the chapter. I know I really shouldn't, but it's just going to make it look better. I mean, I don't want them to have manpower. Okay, first of all, the chapter always has manpower issues, so they're not really going to need that much of an increase if I do this anyways for Black Mountain. 14,000, 15,000 is not bad. Good Springs, eh, this is, looks okay. That's a course A2, so I don't want to have any issues. Uh, Richard Stevenson? Sure, why not? Mm, buffer, spring buffer mechanism. This just looks better. Well, it really doesn't look great, to be honest with you. But in the end, all of California is going to be under me for the most part. Actually, I might just get, take this away from them to... I'm going to take Nipton away as well. Hmm, we'll see what happens. 
Once the war's over, I actually probably give this and the, this part to Hopo, so then it looks even better. There we go. That's probably what I'll do. Yeah, that that'll make it definitely look a lot better. Uh, what was that airbase? Oh, it's up here. That it. Good. Yeah, we'll definitely use some more uh, ground support. Yeah, combat blimps. They're really not useful. Like I said before, I hope they really get looked at again sometime. Because their stats, straight garbage. Well, maybe they're not too bad. Ground attack's 15. Fighters, ground attack is 6. So they're, they're not completely useless, but for the amount of cost that they require, just not worth it. I'm sorry, just not worth it. Internal rotary feeding systems? Nice. Very nice. Anything else around here? Not really. So some updated equipment, so that's the way we can afford. Other things. Manage our subjects. Meh. Who's hopeful is under us now? Brotherhood propaganda. A little bit of manpower. I'm kind of waiting for these guys to betray, betray us. They didn't really get any more manpower anyway, so. Waiting for these guys to betray us. Oh, wait, hold on. Can they not do that? Has a border with any member of the NCR. Well, they might eventually have one. Maybe. Maybe. And we should be able to go to war very, very soon. Floating fortresses, nice. Gonna grab some emergency ceiling. Yeah, might as well. There we go, see? Not bad. Alright, time to commit a problem. Come and repair if you need it. Three. Two. Operation Big Problems. Here we go. Well, we've got an autosave first, apparently. And here we go. Oh, they attack us immediately. I see. Oh, they're, oh, our guys are trying to defend our border. How cute of them. You guys are up where? You're over there. Just defend. You guys defend. You guys got to help attack for that right now. Oh, guys. Come on. Desert Rangers. You were the group I specifically wanted to go to war with first. Honor your alliance. They won't be able to break us here, which is good. Well, I might have misspoke. Yeah, no. I'd rather take a little bit more damage right now first. Uh, yeah, what, what have you decided to attack? You actually might be able to do pretty darn well around here. Not bad. There we go. That's what we want to see. A complete destruction of the Ranger capital. Which I'm probably just going to annex Nevada. Or just Desert Rangers. I'm not going to puppet them. I'm just going to straight up annex them. I'll get some of this territory to Megopolis 1, but... They already are not doing that well. So... Not bad, not bad. How are we doing it against... That's nice. That's really nice. Killed off a lot of the SSMS. Or the Shady Sands Republic. Oh, I still have you guys. We gotta bite you guys. Uh, I'll throw you guys right here. Cover the line. There we go, nice. Sunk a ship, cool. Nice, nice, nice. Keep going, keep going. So I think these guys will put up a little more of a fight. That's good. And we, let's start thinking about the next group we need to get rid of. Uh, yeah, we probably need to go to war with these guys. But I want to address someone's comment from earlier. There we go. Come on, Desert Rangers. Colla collapse, collapse, collapse. We got soldiers to rescue. And rescue them, we did. Destruction of Ranger Citadel, beautiful. Absolutely glorious. There you go. Do it like that. There you go. Good luck. Help them out here. Take them all out. None can live for today. Uh, I'm going to have you not go crazy like that. You can go there, though, if you really want to. Beautiful. They've only lost 33,000 so far. Obviously not enough in my book. Okay, seriously, just go for the capital. Don't get encircled, you dingus. Oh yeah, we have our ciphers. Thanks for reminding me, uh, military Shady Sands folks. Beautiful. Oh, we took the capital. Nice. The fall of Shady Sands. Oh yeah, I got guys all the way up here, huh? That's not good. Scavenger, Urgent, Triumphant. Great! Loudspeakers. They get more physical power and stuff like that, too, huh? 
Nice. Very nice. Grab some 37mm twin mount guns. This looks like one giant mess. And it is. But it's our mess. So you guys come over here. You guys come over here. Ah, uh, a brilliant, a great front line. Oh, these soldiers are trapped right here. That's not bad. Not bad. Oh, you guys are coming through here. But they do not go through this area. Huh. Who's leading this group? The Twisted Hairs. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Brotherhood propaganda. Very good. After this war, we should be able to go to war with the uh, Timberline pretty quickly. And the next episode, we will finish off the Pacific, going all the way up here. Take out the Timberline, maybe Heaven's Gate, maybe New Vegas as well, and call it a campaign, perhaps. Low back feeding system's cool. Now, we good, White Legs or Ammonites. We, we're pretty good right now. No upgrades yet. Level 8, he's level 8, though. He's not a Fox yet, but he's working on it. And they should capitulate mm, within a few hours, hopefully. Let's see. Eh, they're only 79% of the way there. We've only killed off 40,000 of them, so... Give it a little bit more time. In the meantime, I'm gonna send you guys back up north. Just in case this gets finished already. So, we have someone up here to deal with the situation. Uh, no, 80s, we are pretty good. Wartime administration, reaffirm our control, that's fine. Keep going, we don't need extra help right now. Cool. God, I love power armor too much. I really do. Well, hold on. Who controls this? Oh, scorpions, huh? Yeah, we'll see about that. Now that, see, this is exactly why I want to give him that territory. That looks pretty nice. That's not too bad. And having the Twisted Hairs as a little, like, country, a border country between us and Blackfoot, not a bad idea, too. Not really a bad idea. There we go, my friends. That's what we've been waiting for. Cool. Oh, Bill, you get that, and you get that. There you go. That looks a little uglier, but that's okay. Uh, the Goblins won. You really can't afford to do this, but that's kind of my point why I'm giving you all this stuff. You know what? I'll give you the rest of the Mojave, too. There you go. And Death Valley. Because that's part of the Mojave, I think. I'll take the rest of it because I can probably administer it. Correctly, we'll say. That's kind of ugly, but you know what? We'll fix that later on. Actually, is that Death Valley in the Mojave? It is, so. Beautiful. That's not bad. That's really not bad. Oh, we're missing resources now. Oh, no, no, no. I should have went for that one earlier. Oh, that's my fault. Depth fuse. Go ahead and grab some shrapnel shells. It's cool. Go ahead and grab some torpedoes. Yes, please. After this. How many more days do we have for this? Uh, 25. Well, yeah, it's not too long. We can probably take them out within this last episode here. Uh, the last little few minutes we have together. Hmm. Hmm. I really want to go to war with these guys. I really do. Yeah, why not? It's not a bad idea. Uh, let's see about to get paid soon. Very good. Uh, anything else? Provide power armor to scavengers. You never know what you might find. Emergency ceiling. Come back over here. And go ahead and do some... 20mm rotary autocannons. I love autocannons. We're focusing... There's so much naval stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alright, so that's the case up here. Grab some more air bases. You know what? Grab some radar. We could probably build stuff up pretty quickly. Uh, build stuff up there too. Build one right there for air bases because we're going to need that. Roads were looking pretty awesome. Grab some more things up there. And since the next episode, we're going to go up further up north. I think this will be pretty darn appropriate to do. There we go. Oh, that's looking pretty darn nice. Uh huh. Scrap pots. We got a few scrap pots. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, we need more military factorinos. Oh, I see. That's why. Got a couple more attack planes. Not bad. And they use up a lot of composite materials. Greenhorn, that's what I like to see. If that's the case, next episode we will go to war with Vegas, because I do want to see if these people up north are going to continue killing each other or not. 130 days is quite a bit of time, but that's okay. And let's finish episode by killing these guys off. Nothing says a good goodbye to the end of an episode. Why don't you terminate a couple enemies? Probably. And they're just, it's just straight infantry doing it. Doing a great, great job. Chain gun mechanisms? Why not? 
Beautiful. We've lost a total of eight people. Great cons, Vegas, that's good that they got done. Oh, we've guys up there too. It's nice having allies sometimes, it really is. So, we, so the next episode, like I said earlier, will be the last one. The Pacific Northwest needs to get conquered, and maybe Heaven's Gate New Vegas. Which shouldn't take too long. Uh, New Vegas might give us a little bit of difficulty, but it really shouldn't be too bad. And, very soon, you know what, I think I'm just going to straight up annex them. That looks really nice if we annex them. Sell some outdated equipment. Very cool. Uh, I got. I recommend going just to Imma, Imnaha. That'd be pretty darn good. Cool. And it's going to look pretty darn good right now. But regardless, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you tomorrow in the last episode in which we shall expand our influence all over the, the Pacific Northwest. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.